I grew up in a family that went to church every Sunday. All my aunts and uncles and cousins were there. And um, I think it was more of a social experience for us. We really, uh, we didn't have, I didn't have a personal relationship with God. And I don't think I had ever heard the gospel at that point. We just went to church because it was what we did. When I went away to college, I had to take a sociology class and the professor was teaching about Christian mythology. She specifically was teaching about all different kinds of mythology, but when Christianity came up, I was confused and I raised my hand and I said, but the difference is ours is real. And she all but patted me on the head like, oh, poor stupid you. Um, all of these cultures thought their gods were real and yours is no different. Christianity is a myth. And I was crushed. I mean, I just had never heard that before. And because I didn't have any training in apologetics and had never read the Bible for myself, I didn't have any way to fight back against that. And so I just thought she was probably right. I mean, she was certainly a lot smarter, and better educated than I was. And so I just didn't believe anything for a long time until my husband and I were about to get married. I was in my early 30s and we hadn't been going to a church. We didn't have anybody to perform the ceremony, actually. We had um, booked the conservatory and we had a harp player and a band and all kinds of things booked, but we didn't have anyone to do the ceremony. I knew Pastor David through my work and I knew that he was a pastor, so I said to him, do you know anybody who could maybe do our wedding ceremony? And he said, well, how about me? And I said, no, 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 I don't, I don't think that'll work. And he said, come on, just come to our church and check it out. If you like the way we preach, you like the way we do things, great. If not, you know, no hard feelings, it's fine. And we came and we've been here ever since. John and I have been married 15 years. When we first walked into NAPC, it was being held in the school cafe gymatorium, and I had never attended a church like that before. I was, wasn't in a church building. And it felt very easy to walk in. People were very friendly, and it wasn't overwhelming. People were just friendly and kind. I felt very much at home. Pastor David did our premarital counseling, and during that time, he answered all of my questions. I had so many questions, and he was so patient and kind with me. And a few weeks into our premarital counseling, just before we got married, I gave my heart to the Lord. And I would love to say my life has been perfect ever since, but the truth is we've been through some hard times. But I know now we have just this wonderful, loving church family. And more than that, a God who loves me through everything, who is sovereign over everything, and whom I can trust to hold my whole life and my eternity in his hands. We've gone from Sunday mornings on the couch, reading the newspaper, drinking coffee, to getting everybody up and excited to worship and to see all of our friends and family at church and to have the experience of the joy worshiping the Lord on that day. My life has been changed by Jesus through NAPC. Why don't you come see how your life can be changed too?